What's up, y'all? I watched a video yesterday that was like players that made the most in each spot on the court. It was an ESPN video, and it was a lot of Dirk, and it made me miss Dirk so much. So I went onto YouTube, I typed in Dirk, and clicked on the first video. I'm almost guaranteed this video is going to get demonetized, so if you leave a like, that's enough for me. I just felt like watching a bunch of Dirk highlights. He is my favorite uh, front court player of all time. I, I can't say anything else about him. It's a 10-minute video of Dirk's highlights. He's got more than that, but we'll settle. This is what we settling for. Tune in, baby. Tune in, because some of y'all were too young to see the good, the best version of Dirk. Turn this up a little bit. Like 20-year-old Dirk Nowitzki. Who, you ask? Well, the Dallas Mavericks thought highly enough of Nowitzki to engineer a draft day trade with the Bucs. One of the biggest finessings on draft day. I think it was Robert Track the trailer from the Bucks. Rest in peace to him. Rest in peace to uh, David Stern right here. But, like, that is a big-time trade. The sky's the limit for Dirk. He doesn't think he belongs. Look at the fit. He eee, he dripped the, out. He got the little watch. Eee, Dirk had the little drip on him. Out of the last draft behind Michael Oluwa Candy. Do you agree? Well, I don't know if he's the second best talent. Little did you know he was going to grow up to be the best talent. I don't know. what Michael Oluwa Candy didn't do nothing in the NBA. I don't know if it was because of injuries or he was just a straight up bust. He had nothing on what Dirk ended up doing in his career. You know, look at this. Ugh. This is young Dirk. Then we're going to have, like, German Jesus when he had the long, flowy hair. Watching him win a championship. Watching him win a championship was one of the most happiest times I've had as an NBA fan. You know, because nobody, nobody deserved it more. When it comes to loyalty, it's him, Kobe Bryant. You know, it's just like, it's a small group of guys that have this unlimited amount of loyalty to an organization. Russell Westbrook was on that trajectory, and he would have stayed loyal if everything would have would have fit right. You know, Dirk. He had was this a comeback game, bro? One of these games, they came back, and they were down by like 18 or something in the fourth quarter, and they were like, you know what? Or was it late third quarter? They're like, you know what? We're gonna win this game and and win this series. Dirk. Ah, uh, y'all traded me on draft day. Take this. Take this shooter's touch. Mm. Mm. I love the loyalty from Dirk. That's the one of the biggest things, bro. First career points right here. 1999. Came at the free throw line. Beautiful. Beautiful. 1999. And he didn't stop there. He continued to let it go and continued to just, just the shoot and touch. One of those gifted shooters, natural shooters I've ever seen. Imagine being this big and being able to stroke the ball like this. You know what I'm saying? It's just beautiful. Uh. If I was if I was seven foot tall, I'd want to rock the number 41. Honestly, if I was seven foot tall, but I'm not. So I'm not trying to rock that big ass number. You gotta be a big man to rock a number like that. Uh, Dirk. Bang. Shut up, Miami fans. Shut up. Shut up, Miami fans. Yeah, this is uh whew. This is a series. This is a series. I think this is a series where LeBron had a terrible fourth quarter in every single game. Where J.J. Barea was put on LeBron and he did a good thing. You know what I'm saying? And just the... Uh, Tyson Chandler was there. Uh-uh. What a move. Beautiful. Just all net. Pure. Beautiful rotation. Hold on. No. Oh, wow. 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 Darren Williams, okay. Find Dirk, though. How do you lose Dirk, Cal Corver? How do you lose Dirk? How did I know that was Cal Corver? I see the number. I see the number. You, that's the one person on that team. I'm like, find him and make sure he doesn't get the shot up. <laughs> because everybody else I'm, I'm okay with. Oh, my God. What is this? How old? Oh, my God. He's a man. He's, like, probably 14 years old in these clips. But he's so big compared to the rest of them. Getting it off the glass and go oh he was wearing the number 14 back then. Ooh, okay. Alright. Sean Bradley on the court with him. Never had a quick first step, but always knew how to get past his defenders when he needed to. And if he couldn't get past them, just best believe that fadeaway jump shot was getting out of that tool toolbox, man. Just straight up baller, bro. Dirk. Mm, high off the glass. High off the glass. Oh, yes. Give me some more HD footage. Thank you. 
Jeremy Evans? Come on, Jeremy Evans ain't got nothing to do. Yeah, that, there's a reason he not hooping no more. You can't keep up. You can't keep up. Easy. Mm, Carl Landry? Is that Carl Landry? Uh, another one. All-time leading score. He's up to nine right there. Oh, I'm sorry. He goes up to eight right there. Come on, bro. Ooh. And OT. Count him. Big time shot. Back to the finals. What a move. And that's on LeBron. Mm. This is like prime LeBron defensively, too. Boop. Got him. Up and under like he's Akeem Olajuwon. Smaller defender. The fade. Come on, man. This just makes me smile. Austin is guarding you? Is that Austin? That was a bucket. Another one in OT. The Charlotte Bobcats, no way. This makes me happy to watch these highlights, bro. It's just so, it's such unguardable moves. Chris Webber, man, I have this dance and dunking on people. Whew, no call. you like, where's my call at? The Warriors, buckets. He's just one of those players that, like, it didn't matter. Because his jump shot, his release was so high. Add a seven-footer with a high release, you can't block his shot. He sees right over you, and he sees the basket, and it's just a bucket. There's a 50-piece. Mm. Who would have thought when this man was drafted that he was going to end up winning a league MVP? Literally nobody, I would guess. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, now we got the... Olympic Games, FIBA Games, World versus... Oh, no, no. This is World versus USA. Yo, Young Dirk, World versus USA was like, hold on. I got the world. I got the world. Who is that trying to take the charge? Get out my way. Get out my way. Chris Bosh, I'm sorry, but I got to do this to you. I got to do this to you. Cut the deficit and hit the game winner. Oh, the spin. So slow with it. So nasty. I've never got to see Dirk play live, unfortunately. And we never had the funds to see him play live. And by the time we did have the funds, he was out of the league. So I never got to see my boy play live. But I'm okay with just watching highlights right now. And I'm cool with just watching highlights. I guess the Bulls. I don't remember this. This brand new to me. Vince Carter kick out. What are you doing, Luau? What are you doing, Luau? Bearded Dirk. Whew. Baseline jam. Nick Hollison, another player that's all about his loyalty. Nick Hollison. Uh, buckets. I can't even tell you what the hell going on in that clip. I can't see it. I can't see a thing. You know, he's just one of those players, man. And I'm going to go down the list of players from this era. I'm talking early 2000s era. Like, I haven't seen them play in a long time and I miss watching them. Like, best believe we're going to get to a Steve Nash video. We're going to get to a Jason Kidd video. We're going to we gonna get to a lot of greatness. Best believe we will. Franchise playoff high, 47 in this game. And look at Steve Nash. This is after Steve Nash went to Phoenix after leaving Dallas. It's not his fault, though. It's not his fault. He wanted to stay. But the Mavericks didn't match that money. The Mavericks didn't match that money. And can you imagine if him and Steve, Na Steve Nash and Dirk stayed together for a long period of time? They could have got that championship early in 2011. You know, he ended up getting Jason Kidd eventually. But he could have got it earlier, maybe. You don't know. You never know. You never know. Beautiful. One of the most, again, I was so happy when he won that championship, bro. Because you got to think of all the things that was going on. Everybody, including me, hated the Heat. Everybody hated the Heatles. So to see the underdog team come in and destroy LeBron and them, oh, man, and, it ha and it's Dirk too? Come on, man. You can't hate Dirk. Unless you're, I guess, at this point, unless you're a Miami Heat fan. Maybe you hate Dirk. I don't know. But he's just one of those beloved people. You know, he came out. He hooped. There's a game where he came to it with the, with the cookout plate, with the tin foil on it, the aluminum foil on it. He married himself a sister. You know what I'm saying? Dirk is just, just that guy, bro. Dirk is just that guy. I wonder if he has a son. Like, imagine his son. Seven-footer, just like his dad. But he's going to be, he'd be light-skinned. You know what I'm saying? A light-skinned guy with the last name Nowitzki. That's like a, the most German last name you could think of. But he's light-skinned. Mm, Bruce Bowen. 
one of the greater defenders of this era. Still could keep up. Still could keep up. Mm. Surge, one of the greater defenders of this. Surge had like a five to six year period where he was like one of the top defenders in the league. Now he's still good. Don't get me wrong. He's still good. But there was like three, four, five years where he was like leading this, the league in blocks and making defensive teams and stuff like that. And there it is. The ultimate moment. Karan Butler was on that team. Tyson Chandler was also on that team, which was another reason why I rooted for them, man. Brian Cardinal. Brian Cardinal gets a ring. Sean Marion. Oh, I got to rewatch this series now. I forgot Sean Marion was on this team, bro. Jason Terry. Shout out to him, bro. This just has so many players on this roster that I really messed with. None more. None more than Dirk. And I guess Mark Cuban, too. You know, he went on the roster, but he's a part of the organization. Uh, yeah, shout out to Dirk. Let me know in the comment section other people y'all want to see me watch or just other videos in general. I really appreciate it. Thank y'all so much. I'm out. Peace.